we are not prepared to introduce remote work if it is going to decrease the level of production, decrease the rate of, decrease the quality of service to the public. Public Administration Minister Alison West during the Senate's budget debate on Wednesday as she gave an update on the government's plans for remote work or work from home policy for the public service. Minister West first recalled that when the government was forced to close down the economy while keeping certain essential services of the public service in operation during the COVID-19 pandemic, quite a few public servants were required to work from home. And since then they've been asking, well, if I successfully work from home during the COVID, why can't I work from home now? Because there are so many benefits to be gained from working from home. Um, and our response to that is, yes, while we had to work from home during COVID and we managed to keep things afloat, there were tons of things that were not ready that, were, that didn't run as smoothly as they could because everybody is not as able to work from home, as ready to work from home, or as self-motivated as they should be. The public administration minister said a decision was made by the government to undertake a study as many of those who support a remote work policy say the benefits include less or no time in rush hour traffic and less stress. So what we undertook to do was a study to determine one, whether Trinidad and Tobago is ready for remote work, two, what categories of jobs can accommodate remote work what is required to facilitate remote work, how do we treat with it, who would be responsible for what, that kind of thing. Minister West said a consultant has been engaged by the Public Administration Ministry but did not identify the consultant by name. However, the Public Administration Minister indicated to the Senate that the study is now at a crucial stage. They have embarked in the study, consulting with a wide range of people and so on. They will come back to us. With, we will do a pilot project within the next month. We will start a pilot project. And the plan is for them to report to us by, the, by February so that we can take to the Cabinet a position with a recommendation on whether we move forward with remote work or not. Minister West then made clear what would be the government's key consideration. I keep saying to people who ask me that the most significant decision we will have to make in respect of whether or not we introduce remote work is how the introduction of remote work will impact on the productivity in the public service. Minister West told the Senate once the government makes a final decision, it will inform the public service and others. Jewel Brown, TV6 News.